Hey, Jordan Love showing off his acting skills on a pregame show with some scenes from Love Actually. He recreated <laughs> that. No recreation needed inside that historic Packer locker room after the win. Give it up to everybody in this room. First seventh seed in the history of the NFL. Yeah. Howie, we know where the Green Bay Packers are headed. They're going to San Francisco next week. The question is, what's the future of the Cowboys? Boy, there's a lot to unpack there. Wow. You know, and, I, and I'm not sure what the decision is going to be. You've got to make a decision on your, your head coach. You've got to make a decision on your defensive coordinator. If, in fact, you make a decision on your head coach. But it's become... You wonder why all the detractors of the Cowboys have fun every year. It's the same story every year, and it's once again, it's a repeat. Uh, this is a talented football team that's underachieved. Uh, yeah. and, and it right out of the gate today, they came out. Their defense didn't play well. The offense didn't play well. Right across the board. Yeah, you know, I have a relationship with Mike McCarthy. I'm not going to lie to you, oh, America. Mike I like man. him. I like yeah, him a lot. It's just hard for me to say negative things man. about yeah. him. But at three seasons at 12 and 5, you would think would be enough. But, Jay, I got to say, as he walked off that field and Jerry Jones being at 81 years of age, saying maybe to himself, I've got to make a change now at head coach. Does he do that? Because well, this, this is the football team they honestly – They've underachieved. Jerry was asked about Mike's future last week, and he said, we'll see how each playoff game goes. So it wasn't exactly a vote of confidence there. And you also brought up Dan Quinn. Like, if they moved on from Mike, do they go with Dan Quinn? But you just can't do that. They'll have to interview several people. And Dan Quinn is already on the list for four other teams as well. So they do have a lot of coaching decisions to make in Dallas. Yeah, I don't think Dan Quinn did himself any favors today. I still think Dan will be a hot yeah. candidate around the league. Regardless, he'll still be up there, despite this one game. But All right, that's the future of that team of and other teams around the league, maybe involving Dan Quinn. And that's waiting for Jerry Jones there wow. in Dallas wow. to talk to the media. I think a lot of people were interested to see about the future of Mike McCarthy it's because they just had that feeling it's beforehand. It's a unique and complicated organization. Only yeah. in uh, Dallas but, do you but see But also look what Mike feels, did with Dak this year. It feels like you're there putting on a performance as a player instead of being a football player. It feels like so theatrical. And that's what I think gets lost in all of this. When we were even that's there the for Jimmy's ceremony, it felt very, that's you know, you walk into part. and you got the fans like, yeah. let the players play football. They're football players. They're not Broadway performers. They were not loose today at all. Not at yeah. all.